So it's generally accepted that around 3,000 years ago the chariot was replaced by the horse as the premium way to get around quickly. And you might just be surprised by how expensive it was to own a whole chariot compared to a single rideable horse. So not only do you need between two and four horses, but these animals, being social creatures, also need to get along. One can't be significantly faster than the other, and they need to be able to work as a team. And it's much easier to teach one horse to do what you say than it is to teach four to obey commands simultaneously. Riding a horse is dangerous and takes skill, but driving four horses from the back of a bouncing chariot is more dangerous and takes more skill. So much skill, in fact, that being a charioteer needs to be your main gig. So you better be a landed aristocrat with a passive income, or you just won't have the time to get good at charioteering. Riding a horse, however, that can just be a hobby, and your income only needs to provide for one animal, not a whole herd of them. And that is some of the reasons why charioteers turned into equestrians.